Hello everyone, West Productions 100 here. It's coming to you on uh, June 27, 2023 in the Chicago area. I'm making this video because of the wildfire situation. I prompted me, inspired me to do a video about this because uh, for the past couple of days I've noticed, I, can't, I couldn't help but notice just how foggy it's been, how cloudy it's been, how hazy it looks. You know, areas that I could see for like miles ahead, if it was for clear skies, you know, it's like it's like a fog settling in the in the air and in the, on the ground around me. It's a uh, it feels weird so far, and I know that the the East Coast of the United States got a bunch of the same thing happen to them too with the New York City metro area and the other parts of the East Coast, as like Philadelphia, and now it looks like the Midwest region is getting hit by something similar. I don't know if it's a, not as severe as what like happened to like Philadelphia or New York City, but uh, not too uh, not too uh, encouraging though. Um, my weather app has it uh, has been is giving uh, you know advisories and stuff like that. It has a ranking system of air quality, and uh, around here it's around the 160 area. It's below 200, but it's still enough for an advisory. I'm not an expert on the air quality meters, but you know it's might be telling you something there where uh, we're saying that and uh, yeah but people are still out here playing pickleball and tennis and stuff like that so some people don't seem too um, concerned yet people are still willing to go outside and uh, I mean yeah it's not too bad I suppose the warning advisory did mention that to be careful if you are like if you have health issues if you're sensitive air sensitive to the air um, I don't know if I'm one of those people, I'll be honest with you all, but, uh, yeah, it's, uh, just thought it'd be interesting to report on this. I mean, like, you know, you look down this road here, for instance, on a clear sky day, it doesn't look like this. And it's looked like this all day today. It's all fog and mist is in the air. And it just looks like something out of Silent Hill video game series. When I mean, you look over here, too, it's, like, cloudy and foggy. And, uh, when you read the news reports about how it's... From the wildfires up in Canada, you know, can't help but think about how it's impacting it. Um, I, I and uh, so I'm feeling decent right now myself. I'm not feeling like too uh, health wise. I don't feel like too concerned. Although I will say, yesterday I did I smelled in a Chicago suburb what what smelled like smoke or like wood burning, which is giving an idea of how far the wildfires are traveling down. You know, to hear the small smoke, you know, it just felt like, so I just couldn't help but notice the small smoke or wood burning in the air. And currently right now, I also can't help but notice that my eyes feel a little irritated right now um, as I'm walking right now, walking to my, to my train station. Um, so there's also that, but, uh, you know, I'm still gonna, you know, keep hanging in there, hanging in there, hanging in there, and stuff like that. It's not like I'm out in this, in this environment for hours all day or something like that. I didn't, I did notice some maintenance workers who work on like lawns and stuff like that. I noticed them out here. I was curious what it's like for them, because they're working out here anyway. Are they used to this? Is this something, you know, an issue that they're experiencing? I'm not sure. Maybe they're more used to it, because I work in a. I'm working inside, I work inside in the office environment. So I work indoors a lot of the times. So maybe I'm just not used to this, the air like this. But yeah, um, I just can't help but notice that like, my eyes feel a little irritated right now. And maybe it's not from the smoke or from the, from the clouds, but it could be from something else possibly too. I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I just thought I'd give you an up to start to document this moment. That's that's mainly why I'm doing this, documenting and commenting on it. I honestly cannot remember a time like this off the top of my head. Not like this. Maybe one time possibly, but like it was like a one-off, like you know, be like a day or two, something long like that. If I'm if if I, if, if I'm if I'm even remembering that correctly. This, however, is different because it's been persisting for so long, it's been going on for so long already, 
and it's not even July yet. It's still June. It's late June. But like, you know, how a few weeks ago, it was impacting the East Coast badly. Like, like double, like the, the warning signs were like, the warning meter was like double what it is right now. It was pretty high. So, um, but uh, that being said though, it is a little, it is concerning how consistent it's been here as well. For the past few days, there's been some of the fog over the air for the past couple of days. On Sunday, it was clear with some like scattered rain, but starting yesterday, I couldn't but notice just how foggy it was while driving to Chicago and seeing the skyline. You can, you can even see the skyline for miles and miles, just showing how cloudy and foggy it was. Um, so, and just other spots I'm used to seeing for, for a long distance, and it's like I can't even see it because it's so foggy. So, I don't know how long this is going to last for. It could last like a few days, it could last a little bit more. Um, but yeah, it's just crazy though. I can't recall it being like this on and off like this for weeks in different parts of the United States and Canada. So we're just waiting to see, I guess, what happens. Um, maybe take more precautions, I suppose. Um, but yeah, just I record this again. It's June, it's June 27th, 2023. Um, and this region of the United States and Midwest has been on and off with forest fire smoke. Along, it's like switched from like the Midwest to the East Coast and now it's back to the Midwest again. So Just hang in there and uh, like I said earlier something I never really see, see I never see I never seen I, don't, I, I never seen this persistent I cannot recall ever being this persistent like this again like a one-off if I'm even remembering that correctly so yeah um, document this moment here and uh, Take care everyone stay well. Bye. Bye Like look at this for example here, like how foggy it looks there in the distance with the trees over there and in the, in the in the background over there. You know how just it's like a shroud. It's like the shroud or this haze of. It's like the shroud or this. It's like this. It's like this shroud or this haze of fog over there. That's a uh, pretty wild to me, considering there's no storms right now. It's just it's just been like this all day. Yeah, just an example of this compared to what it'd be like if it, if that wasn't there. It'd be a different story. So yeah.